Hey yo, peace everyone. Welcome to another episode of JL Jupiter TV. Today we're currently here at Alex Bakery. This is not just your ordinary bakery shop. They sell tacos here. They got food here. And I'm truly excited. Make sure you guys stay tuned. Make sure you subscribe to the channel. Let's get it going. <laughs> Very, this is a very, very unassuming place for some good quality tacos, man. And it's a, like a convenience store. It's a bakery shop. Miz over here talking about, oh man, it smells, it smells so, so good, good in here. here it does actually smell Ooh. real good. It has some like snacks you can get, uh, some tortillas. They got matagoya. They got drinks here. What else they got? They got your basic necessities for home, hot sauce. They got spices. I just love it. They got ice cream too. And they got cakes, man. I got a three-year-old. I didn't know they actually do like Spider-Man cakes. Look, they got. People come in here surprised that you sell they, that you sell tacos too. Yeah, some people they don't see that they sell food because we don't have like promotion. Right. Promotion, right. yeah. But we make or we sell like tacos, platters, okay. um, cakes, yeah. bread, and the store. We have the, the grocery store too. The first time I came in here, I thought it was just a bakery, and then I seen tacos on the wall. I'm like, wow. Now you're talking my language, so this yes. is a, a nice, nice little small shop here in Woodland, right? Yes, that's uh, uh, 1614 Ferry Avenue. Yeah, come, come check her out. What's your name? Sylvia. Sil come check out Sylvia here. Mm -hmm. These tacos look fresh. They got bakeries here. They got little household, uh, household items too. I can't wait to try it out. So, and yeah. what, would you open seven days a week too? It's open seven days a week, eight to ten. Eight, eight to ten. Wow, every day. Look at that. Yes. You hear that? Seven days a week from 8 a.m. to 10. Tacos every day of the week. Come check her out. nice little shindig back here so this actually opens up really nice so you get uh, kind of like grocery store convenience store when you first walk in tacos fabulous tacos and they got an eat-in spot here too and look it opens it opens up really nice it's like six seating big chairs I'm about to and <laughs> you know they got a whole DJ booth over here so it looks like they they you can order uh, your cake here and actually have your quinceañeras here as well too so look at Miz he about to put on the hat <laughs> My boy Mizzy Bone here. You guys wonder why I call him Mizzy Bone? Because this man is in love with Bone Thugs and Harmony movement. Yeah. Oh yeah, Bone Thugs and Harmony got that challenge going. I mean that, that verse is going on. Bone Thugs and 3-6 Mafia. Who you got? Come on now. 
I ain't even gotta answer that question. They gonna ask a question like that, y'all. That's right. So let's get get let's get the hand sanding. Oh yes. That's that. Awesome. Thank you so much. Uh, my boy, my boy in love right now, man. So I asked her, I'm like, I ordered the tacos. We got we got the Tinga and we got the Al Pastor. Those are bomb. And I'm like, do you guys have like some hot, like some jalapenos? She went back there and she got me some jalapenos. So thank That's you so much. Onions. That's some onions. Let me show y'all. Oh, shit. Look at this. This is going to be magnificent in those tacos. Look at that. I mean, it's some dangerous times, man. So cleanliness is next to godliness. This is, this is just, you know, normal practice for us. It smells good. Yeah. Shout out to the hand sanitizer. Yeah. Oh, my goodness. Which, okay, I got the tamarind Jerico. The punch. This is the tamarind one. Well, cheers. Cheers, my brother. Cheers, cheers to y'all. Love me some tamarind. We use a fruit punch today. We use tamarind to make sauce. Man, bro. Yeah. So let's do this. Let's do the reveal. Um, I don't know, whatever's on top first. Look at this. Your 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 beautiful just tacos, man. These are just bright now. Now, Sylvia did say she she gave me the options. I didn't know you can get have options though. She said, do you want cilantro and onions or do you want lettuce, tomatoes, and sour cream? Yeah, that's and it. I was like, I wanted the traditional way, man. This is how I like my tacos. The other way is probably good too, especially she almost had me with the sour cream. I almost said yes to the sour cream, but because we Americanized the tacos, bro. So you yeah, know. that's what it is. So there is an option there. So this is the tinga. Tinga is like a stew, chicken stew. They cook it until the point to the point where the chicken is is tender and it's falling apart. These tortillas feel warm. I feel like this is just giving that chicken a hug right now. Man. So. So do you want the, the hot sauce or the, or the green sauce? Mm, I'm gonna go with the green sauce, man. The green sauce just seems like it's gonna go better. I think so? Yeah. I'm gonna do the hot sauce first. Green sauce just seems like it's gonna go better with that cilantro. Cilantro. Mm -hmm. Do it like that. My boy, my boy chopping it up. Going in. Now I need some jalapenos too, Chief. Oh yeah, oh yeah. Put that right oh, yeah. on there. Oh yeah. Ask them for the grilled jalapenos. Maybe they might charge you more, maybe they won't. You want me to take care of your, your taco too, man? Sure, man, sure. Shucks. This is the ver verde sauce. I don't yeah, even verde, know. Verde, verde. Green verde. We're going to do heavy, heavy on that. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Just like that. Oh, yeah. Talk some of this to too? Oh, yeah. Walk with me. Put some piece of heaven on here. Walk with me. There you go. Look at that. Look how beautiful on, that drop looks. Some, drop some of the panties. Hold on, man. Hold on, man. Here you go, man. Look how beautiful that looks. Y'all see that? <laughs> All right, cheers. Cheers, my brother. Mm. 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 That just smacks you in the in the taste bud. This has packed with so much. Yo, some jalapenos. Mm. Mm. It's like wrapped in love, man. The best way, I'm telling you right now, you have to get it with the grilled jalapenos and onions. It's mandatory. Get that lime juice in there. And you have a piece of heaven in your hands right now. Mm. 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 Earth that up, Chief. Mm. Mm. You ever had tinga before? I probably did, but I probably know what's called tinga. <laughs> so chicken, fair chicken. Mm. I'll be sure when I go out for now one, I gotta say I want tinga. They're gonna say chicken, no tinga. That bite was amazing. That first bite was amazing. That that's about as good as it gets for me. I, I would never expect tacos that good. Come out of here, right? Yeah. Then yeah. we go on the back, they be like, you see the fresh meat sitting up there. Man. You saw the fresh meat sitting yeah. up there? Right. No, no, no. <laughs> <laughs> the fresh 
animals sitting up there. And yeah, so they're like a full-fledged kitchen back there with, with a bakery shop and a nice grill. Yo, it's it's really like a good quality place to get tacos. This tinga to me, one of my favorite things that I've ever had. It's the small tingas in life. It's the small tingas. I'm gonna do this because he's my boy and I love him. I'm gonna give him the last tinga. Oh no, you can have that cheap. No, I'm gonna, I'm gonna do the al pastor. Okay. Let me get that one. See? <laughs> Got a new kid on the block when it come down to taco now, man. Nice bakery, man. You've been telling me about it, man, bro. I, you know, yeah. when I was always a, a little hard-headed knucklehead, I ain't listen. Mm. Yo, maybe it's because it's like you have low expectations when you come here, right? But to me, like these, these are some of the best tacos I'd say in town. Um, in their bakery shop, I don't know if they're yeah their bakery shop and they sell tacos. But to me, like I don't know what it is. Maybe you come here for. Uh, a piece of cake and you get some tacos and you're like, wow, this is pretty good. But I don't know, these are some good quality ingredients too. I mean, tacos are fairly simple and they're mm. able to knock this out the park. They're able to knock this out the park for me. Mm -mm -mm. Tacos deserve some tender, it's, it's, some it's TLC, y'all. They deserve some tender love and care. I need y'all to come here and get it y'all way. Like, if you like Americanized way with lettuce, tomatoes, onions, and sour cream, it probably tastes good as hell. I'm sorry, I'm, yeah. I'm, I'm Americanized when it comes to that because I'm not part of the culture, but they good both ways. They, this, this is amazing. Look at that. Look how, how good that the looks. Sour cream just adds that other element to it. Like it's like a cool. Oh, love me some sour cream. So you want to do the green this time? Yeah. Or the red this time? Which yeah, I do red, man. You know. I'm how was the red? Red is great. Mm -hmm. so I'm going to do it just like this. Ooh, man. That was strong. I mean, that's what. You know, heard me, you know, heard the beast come out. All right, I'm ready? I'm ready. Open that ready? up. Yo, this is husky. Like they give you a oh, lot of, of pork in here. This is a very, very husky taco. Let's get it. Mm. Mm. That pineapple just come through, man. That red sauce. The red sauce is banging, oh. I'm telling you, dog. Mm. Mm. So you get that sauce from the smell of pork, but that pineapple just counters it so well, man. Then you get those jalapenos on top. Sweet, the salty, onions. savory, man. Oh my goodness, bro. It's about as savory as it gets with this. You yeah. almost forgot about these nice baked goods in this bag. <clears throat> the place is called Alex Bakery. You better try some baked goods. What this is right here, but it looks amazing. This is a baked goods here at Alex. They do wedding or they do cakes. They have a nice small venue here too. And I don't know, I don't know what catch the name of this. No cheese, cheese pastry. I love me a cheese pastry. Yeah, me too, man. I love cheese Danishes. Man, man. what the one at Wawa? Wait, I ain't had that one yet, man. Love it. You got salt on here, or is this? I think that's sugar. sugar. Either way, we're gonna find out. We're gonna find out what this is. Get this thing, y'all. Ooh, it's ooh. good. Hey, force be with us. Let's get it. I've only had a cup of coffee with this. I think I got coffee. I saw a coffee thing right there. I think I had three cups of coffee already. Let's go. That's exactly what it is. That's exactly what I had. Ooh, that sugar came okay. in. So okay. you working with Chief? Is that cheese or is that custard? It's like a cream cheese type of uh, filling. Mm. I love how... That's custard, see? Is it custard? Mm-hmm. Has a vanilla taste to it. That's custard. I love the way they, the sugar... Oh, God. I love the, the sugar rocks are like, got texture to them too, mm. you know what I mean? Yeah, you could definitely tell. Mm. Look how thick that sugar is on there. Uh, little, little sugar rocks on there, look at that. Oh. Looks beautiful. Yeah, this food was delicious, man. Highly recommended place here. Alex Bakery, Woodland, um, pretty much on the corner of Ferry and Mount Ephraim. Small shop, very unassuming. Uh, parking, though, it's gonna be tough. Parking, maybe, probably get like three parking spots in front of the bakery. Other than that, you may need to park like at the on gas station. the gas station if they let you or on the side street where you have to walk down. But to me, if you're, uh, 
If you work near here, or you're, if you live in the small town of Woodland, or even Oakland or Collinswood, it's a great, this is a great establishment too, man. If you want to get some bakeries and some tacos, to me, it's a no-brainer. So, shout out to Sylvia and the Alex Bakery. Thank you guys for joining us. Follow my bro here. We'll see you on the next episode. Peace.